The resulting explosion was over 1,570 times more powerful than the two bombs dropped on Hiroshima and Nagasaki, with a combined yield of 50 megatons. The radioactive fallout from the explosion would have been catastrophic if the bomb had been designed to yield its intended 100 megatons. Fortunately, the bomb was detonated at a high altitude, causing the fireball to be repelled away from the surface and reducing the amount of fallout. Nevertheless, severe damage extended up to 150 miles from the impact site, and windows in Norway and Finland were shattered by the force of the blast. The world was quick to condemn the Tsar Bomba, and the resulting radioactive fallout could have been catastrophic not only for the Soviet Union, but for neighboring countries as well. Andrei Sakharov, who played a significant role in the Soviet Union's research into thermonuclear weapons, became a strong supporter of imposing limitations on nuclear weapons tests after being horrified by the potential man-made cataclysm that could be half everyone on planet Earth.